So now let's see how we can work with the text fitting options. So in order to do that, I'm just going to go around and take a shape. Let's say, for example, a call out, and then I'm going to take this shape, for instance, and then click and drag it. So what I'm going to do now is type in this is a paragraph just like this. And what I can do is I can copy and paste it out just like this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to work around with the text fitting by going into format options. And over here, you can see that there's text fitting options right here. So I can go around and change the left side so you can see that I can indent it uh, a bit on to the right by using the left one and I can indent it from the right as well. So you can see that it fits on right here. I can increase that out and it fits on just like that. Let me just decrease this and decrease this out as well. So it actually works just like this. So over here, there's a special indentation as well. So I can go around and indent only the first line and I can go around and indent only the hanging line as well. So just like this hanging lines are the ones which are after the first line. So I can indent the first or hang uh, the other. I'm just going to keep it this to none. The next one is the padding. So if I were to go and to click on padding from top. There's the uh, padding from top applied. I can pad from bottom as well. So bottom a padding is applied. I can pad from left or pad from right over here as well. Just like this, as you can see, if I were to right align this, let's say, for example, I'm just going to go around, right align this. And if I were to go to right, you can see that it gets padded from the right as well. And that is how you can work around with the text fitting options inside of Google Slides. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.